Today it's May the 4th and that means it's National Star Wars Day today. Of course, the holiday is a pun on the phrase, may the force be with you, mm -hmm. Tess. Yeah, Scotty, and because of the pandemic, obviously there won't be parties and get togethers all have to be canceled, but not to worry. There's many other things going on. Disney Plus actually debuting a new eight part docu-series called Disney Gallery, The Mandalorian today. Yeah, the behind the scenes look at how the popular Mandalorian series was created. He has interviews and never before seen footage. And if you're more into the classic Star Wars films, well, we have a treat for you because One Valley Pop-Up Drive-In Movie Theater is playing not just one Star Wars films, but two of them tonight. Yes. Drive-In, all for free. Gibby, I know you don't have a monitor, but to go along with you, I've got my lightsaber in hand too. So I challenge you. There you well, you know what? I want to thank Blake Kelly, who let us borrow his. Listen to this. You can hear it as it powers up here. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, nice. I'm kind of scared with ha holding this one. I don't want to mess it up. But here's the thing. I mean, these pop-up drive-in theaters are awesome. This one here is at Sonora Village, just in front of the Best Buy. And it's all part of Steve Levine Entertainment and Jamie joining us. Uh, these are awesome. We've heard of all these pop-up movie uh, drive-ins that come in. Today, May 4th, special movie showing here, two movies out here. But the best part is it's a way to get out of the house, be safe, and have some great food because you have a lot of vendors who are buying it. Absolutely. So, you know, we came up with this concept with Yam Properties, and obviously you can see this amazing screen right behind us. Uh, Inner Technologies has this awesome LED screen where you can drive in, right? And you can watch the movie from the comfort of your car. We've got cars spaced out between six and 10 feet. So we're, pro we're practicing all of the safe guidelines set in place by the CDC. And like you said, if you purchase a movie ticket, you can get that movie ticket reimbursed. So if you spend $20 or more at the participating restaurants in this center, you'll get your movie ticket reimbursed, which is awesome. So it's basically just going out on a date and having movies. You're, you get to bring the family out, but Absolutely. at the same time, you get to enjoy it. And, a great, and the technology you guys are using, you see the folks watching these movies out here. It's just like you would if you were in a drive-in. It's an FM dial. Correct. It gets to listen to the movie there. And depending on the sound system you have in your car, you either have the full surround sound effect or you even have the nice music playing. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And, you know, we have had some really great success here. And like you said, we've got two special features tonight. May the 4th be with you. Uh, and then tomorrow for Cinco de Mayo, we also have some special showings as well. You can log on to azpopupmovies.com to see all of the listings for, for the movies. And again, it's a great price point. It's $15 or $20, depending on how many people you have in your car. And you can get reimbursed by coming and enjoying some food at these great restaurants. All right, it, it is Moonlight Movie Night. And here is the thing, may the 4th be with you, not to mention, they also have one popping up on the west side as well. As you mentioned, just go to their website, get all the information. And yeah, I think I'm staying with this one here.